Hi everybody and welcome to our channel where we talk about homemade cure meat or charcuterie for now. Today we'll see how to produce the number one of the Corsican charcuterie, the Coppa. First you buy a good piece of pig's collar or neck fillet from your butcher. Weight and note it down, mine is 1555 grams. The step of curing with the method EQ curing 4 to 1 with 4% of salt, which is 62 grams of salt from Guérande, 2% of sugar cane, 31 grams, and 1% of wild pepper from Madagascar, which is 15 grams. Seems a lot, but it's all right, believe me. We mix our ingredients and we spread them all over our meat now. We put our piece in a bag and we will vacuum seal it. Try to leave the least possible mixture in your tray. I insist on this kitchen appliance that is really essential to me. We'll use it for the vacuum salting step, but also for the conservation and the maturation of the meat. Sure, we could do without, like they used to do in the past, with the burring or the saturation method, but this process remains much more random. Take the diameter of your piece, divide it by two and you add one, and that gives you the minimum days to leave your piece in the fridge. My meat is 12 cm, so I will leave it for seven days. But we can also leave it much longer and we will try to leave our vacuum seal bag during two or three months in a future video. Let's rinse quickly our piece under cold water, then dry it with some kitchen towel. Some people just prefer to wipe it dry with a cloth. It's up to you. and we put it back to dry 24 hours in the fridge so that the smoke sticks better on the meat. The smoking stage. Just one pass with my smoke generator, which is five to six hours. I will test two passes or 10, 12 hours in the next video to see the difference. Now we move on with the drying step. You need a place with a little ventilation between 10 and 13 degrees Celsius and 65 to 75% of humidity. The goal is to lose between 30 to 40% of the initial weight. We check the weight of our piece every week or so. Don't panic if a white flower develops on your copper. This is quite normal and will only improve its taste. Be careful if this flower becomes green or brown, which means that your drying conditions are not good. In this case, you should dry brush your piece and try to reduce the temperature and especially the humidity. And once we achieve the desired weight loss, we can move on to the tasting. You can see that slightly white flora and the fat that has turned yellow with the drying and the smoking. Not to seem too chauvinistic, the coppa is also found in Italy and Switzerland in the county of Ticino and Grison. Ours has a great smell and I can't resist cutting myself a slice. Nice color inside with a nice marble pattern. The taste is delicious, slightly smoky and peppery. It's really my favorite cure meat and it's so easy to make it at home. It's ready to be tasted, but you could also vacuum pack it to homogenize the dryness and to continue its maturation. I will do this in a future video. Don't hesitate to try at home and leave me a comment. You can subscribe to the channel to support us and not to miss the next videos.